Is that your girlfriend right there? And then what's that guy right there? That's your best friend? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. This forever single ass motherfucker out here, man. Come on. Say what? You had her first? Crazy man! We got a goddamn thruple in the front row. Hold on, you behind the music looking motherfucker! What? What the hell is happening over here? So wait a minute, you guys are all friends. You guys hooked up first. He was in survival mode. Don't take that personally, like. Because I was about to go in. And he's like, I gotta stop this somehow. <laughs> I fucked this girl first! <laughs> Son! Nah, he had that shit cocked, ready to go. The second he found out he was in front row, he was third wheel, he was like, nah, I'm telling everybody, bro, it is what it is. The whole community is going to know. All right? I'm not getting made fun of in front of all these people. Everybody going to know we shared the potato. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Yo, you're a confident motherfucker, bro. That's confidence, dude. I wouldn't even let him sit next to her. I'd sit in the middle. Here I was thinking you're some fucking virgin third wheel motherfucker. You know you're dicking down all your boys' girls. This is crazy. This girl getting so horny she taking off her jacket, man. I don't even know what to say right now. Hold on. Did you just find out this information right now, sir? So how long before you guys started dating? Is this, is this uncomfortable for you, sweetheart? It's not. Yeah, we know. <laughs> we're aware. <laughs> That's why we're having this conversation. <laughs> not only have you been through it, <laughs> they've been through it. <laughs> Don't flip your head. <laughs> And then when'd you guys meet? <laughs> Bro. Bro. The way you started that made it seem like there was a huge gap in between. So you guys were homies before. You've all been, do you work at a restaurant or something? <laughs> You all got divorced around the same time. That's what's up. And there just, there just wasn't another girl. <laughs> the other girls were what? They were two Mormon. Oh, so you guys were just soiling, was it soiling? Sowing your wild oats. So soaking, no, soaking. That's the shit y'all do out here. I swear it, you Mormons are wild motherfuckers. We're gonna get back to this little shit in a second. That soaking shit, I read about that. Soaking? Does anybody here not know what soaking is? Soaking, bro. Or docking, that's another one. So I just found out about this shit too, don't worry about it. So you can't, according to, I guess, uh, Joey Smith, 
sex is defined as thrusting. So what the young Mormon kids do is they don't thrust, they just they just Lego, bruh. They just, they just Lego, dog. They just stick that shit in there and they both wait. They both wait for nothing. Yeah, them Mormon bitches got some Kegel strength out of this world. Strong pussies on these Mormon girls, bruh. Straight face up here, but down there just. Hmm, 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 So, you guys hook up, you guys hook up after, and then you start realizing, you're like, yo, we fucking are a really good couple, both of you guys. <laughs> what is this? Are you not into it? No, no, I'm saying you guys started going, hey, we, we really get along, we like each other. You two. You're not very convinced. <laughs> yo, are you kidnapped right now? Blink once if you are kidnapped right now. We'll save you, sweetheart. It was on again, off again. Okay, and now is it on again? But when on again, off again, were you talking about you on their dicks? Or were you talking about... <laughs> you live in the same apartment building? Oh my God. Whose dick is bigger, yo? Yeah. <laughs> that skinny motherfucker, I know it. I know that skinny motherfucker is big dicked. I know it. And I'm not saying that because you're half Asian. I'm just saying it because the way that he's built. He's also a quarter Italian. He could be packing. You never know. <laughs>